normally i don't like talking about celebrities i don't like talking about people in general i just feel it's none of my business so uh, i don't like talking about them and i just do my own thing but this particular topic really interests me and i feel i have something to say and if i don't say it i probably would not have a rest so i'm just going to talk about it i'm very sure you all saw what um omale did in a concert and i think till now it's still like a topic going around and you know a lot of stuff and i am here to give my own diluted opinion let's get to it apparently um a guy bought a ticket for him and his babe to omale's concert and <laughs> they got there Omale saw this girl and told her to come on stage and she did went on stage and you know they had this um seductive dance kind of i don't find that um decent it was so seductive while the boyfriend was watching her and you know she was just there dancing you know seductively with um omale on stage so i'll be talking about these three persons um omale the girl and the guy and i'll be telling them how they messed up for omale i don't know he might not know that she probably came with somebody or something but if he actually knew then that's all messed up because you want you decided to transfer your pain to an innocent guy Someone that will not that will not do anything for you because so so could not take away your pain you now want that you know shift that pain to an innocent guy i don't know what, what what to say but i just felt he probably should not have called that get out but like i said earlier he might not know she came with somebody you know you know all this um people that are starstruck and you know they, they will just jump on anything thrown at them because when he called the girl she might just be like no she's not going right and that's it but she decided to go so i don't know i don't know what else to say about omale for the guy if um he just left huh immediately you know the girl left his side went on stage i swear you know i would look for him wherever he is and give him a tight hug guy you are not obliged to stay there and watch yourself get disrespected because when the girl left people were pointing camera at him you know to get his reaction and he was you know from his face he was not feeling well like he, he was not having any of that and he just stood there and let people disrespect him no that's the wrong king you, sh you should you should have never allowed that like that moment she left your side just you know Pick up, your, pick up your stuff and vanish and just move away let her um sort herself out and you don't you do not probably have any um business talking to her if you don't want to like that's a valid ground for breakup it is but the fact that you stood there and you know let people make fun of you let people take video of you and uh, nah, 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 you messed up you messed up you should have just left and you know just leave her for the streets leave her for uh, omale and let's see where they'll get to but it's okay it's probably your first time you, you, you don't know it's going to happen to you or something so i'm not really faulting you i'm just saying you should have just you should have just left immediately right yeah and for the lady ah oh my god you know you know sometimes um going through um a very embarrassing situation is not really enough like you know what the, what they call second hand embarrassment oh my god watching that video I was embarrassed on her behalf like it really really made me cringe see it's another thing that you came there alone and you just want to jump on, on stage with a celebrity that's okay even though i would even i would not have done that like i know celebrities like omale rema if they're calling you on stage you know they're just i don't know they're just doing rubbish with you basically if it's a celebrity that you know probably you know is calling you on stage or she's calling you on stage on stage to, to come sing with him or something like that uh, sure i mean who would not like to sing with um johnny drill or see me or something You'd be like, oh yeah he's calling me on stage to probably 
you know, make missing with him or something. But we all know Omale and Rema that they are known for that kind of, you know, atrocity. So even though she was alone, I don't think she should have gone. Like it's, it's so it's so demeaning. Like you are a, you are a queen for crying out loud. You are you are meant to be a queen rather because that um character you you know showed everybody i, I don't I'm, I'm not sure you are you are a queen more like a slave or something but it's okay if she had probably gone alone right she, she could have you know done anything she wants to do she, she would have probably represented herself the way she wants but the fact that she was with a guy your boyfriend that paid for the ticket to come to that concert uh i was so for you oh my god you actually did everything to the extreme did you guys see the way she was dancing? Did you guys see the way she was she was dancing, rocking Omale and all of those things? That was extreme. And you know your so-called boyfriend will be there watching you and you're all that, oh my god. See, there was a video I made about um, you know, celebrities and being starstruck and everything. I'm just pressing that I don't really care about celebrities. I don't know. I don't I don't really give a damn or something. When I look at celebrities, I just look at them like, okay, they are just people like me. They are just known and I'm not, right? But I will not do those sort of rubbish for celebrities. Like, you know, seeing them, I can probably see you and be like, hey, hi, can you call? I'm your fan, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, crying, jumping at you, screaming, rolling on the floor, jumping on you on stage and trying. <sighs> I can't. So she actually has all the faults. She's so wrong in many ways. If she wanted to do something like that, she should have done it alone. To mitigate um, this whole issue, uh, she would have just done it alone. She did not only embarrass herself, she embarrassed herself, her friends, people that know her, the guy, the guy's friends. She embarrassed a lot of people. Me, that I don't even know her, I was embarrassed on her behalf. So, she was so wrong in so many ways. So after I looked at that video and analyzed everything, one thought just came to my head, like, what if it's actually a kind of stage? Like, what if the girl, the guy, Omale, you know, they just stage this thing, you know, to make headline, something like that. Because how does Omale know there will be a girl coming to the concert with um, her boyfriend and he was going to call this girl out? And there would be a curtain, you know, that would be dropped down to show their um, silhouette or something like that. Because when the guy came on stage, they were dancing and all of a sudden a curtain went down and we could only see what they were doing from their shadow. Like what if it's all stage, you know, to make headlines, to make topics, to make opinions fly around like, like it's flying around right now, to make um, that concert kind of... Um, popular people will, you know talk about it and this and that what if what if it's staged because if it's staged they are basically working for their money and you know people can do many things for money not me though not me you will be safe that's kind of things i can't do for money you know there are people that will recognize her and you know start dragging her even though it is staged right and they will not really know it is staged or something or she's, she's just working for her money but even though it is staged right i don't know she'll be dragged the guy will be dragged Amale is probably being dragged and stuff like that. But it's okay. Because I'm trying to think somebody in her normal sense should not really do something like that. So it might really be staged because I've not really seen anywhere where people say, okay, yeah, I know them. They are really dating. They've been together for, you know, two, three, four years or something. I've not really seen a Twitter like that on Twitter. So it might actually be staged to, you know, um, drag attention to that concept. So I'm just trying to think out of the box and not be too judgmental here. I want to kind of um, assess the whole situation to know what is possible and what is not. Because thinking about it again, if it's not stage, if it's not stage, like if it's really, really real, right? There was so like there was so much uh, English again. Is it so much or so many? Choose one. You have a uh, blank, you know, check. Just pick one. There was too many, too many, yeah, as English. There were too many body contacts, like, you know, body contact, touching her. There is no way Omale would not would not have touched her sensitive body part or something, or there's no way probably they would not have exchanged co uh, contact or something. But this one, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just imagining, right? So yeah, this is well.
but in general yeah i just feel artists should stop bringing people out to the stage and you know do those rubbish with them because one day you will go to a concert where you really have a fan that really really love you that really wants to be on stage with you you know jump with you sing with you and he or she might be scared you want to start touching her or something if you want to bring people up on, on stage don't 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 do those rubbish to them well basically artists should just stop bringing our people to the stage it's not sexy nah it's got that behavior basically i think when people start talking more about this then we'll, we'll start from somewhere but for now i don't know <laughs> and to actually think every situation like this that we've seen is always a girl that's with her boyfriend like and they really kind of doing this in a, uh, intentionally to bullshit the guy or something it's always it's always a guy um a girl rather with a boyfriend Godao, it's not fair it's not fair pick a guy up and bring him on stage you guys should jump together abby is a fun too is that because of you <sighs> well so yeah that is my honest opinion i don't have anything to say and i'm just being reasonable as possible like i'm trying to think about many factors that must have you know been in play and i just gave my honest opinion based on that but if this whole thing is actually not stage and it's true the girl did not only belong on the streets she belonged like in the neighborhood in the community but that's okay that's all i have to say and i would want you guys to talk about your own opinions what you think who you would blame what you will blame how you will blame them everything and do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel like and share and that's pretty much it but i really want your opinion on this topic so i'll see you guys in my next video bye -ya.